Hello, and welcome back to Dyson's Fair program. I'm Avon. In the last episode, we finished Red Science and Blue Science. Well, I guess we shouldn't say completely finished. Well, we did, but I want to approve it a bit. We want, uh, let's see, we got this now. Good. I think we want the vertical construction as well. And then we're going to do all the upgrades. Maybe I should have done this first. No, this is fine. So we're going to do the upgrades. Uh, there is a lot to do in this episode. So I'm just going to queue a couple of things. Let's see. There we go. Maybe we want this as well. So we want a few more labs just to improve the basic things. Let's see. Ten. Is that enough? It might be. Um, yeah, probably is. So that's nice. Um, let's see. We also want more power. At the end of the last episode, our power was running a bit low. So let's do that. We need to, let's see. Yeah, good. Oh, we also need to improve our poor mech, but I guess the upgrades are coming. Let's queue that actually. The um this yes. So here we go. Um this is you have unlocked the vertical construction technology. Yes, thank you, Mr. Tutorial. We are going to add some more labs here. And here. And do we need here? I think. No, we don't have enough red to increase this. So let's see. Uh, what we can do here, though, is add one more here. We can remove this. So we need more belt here, more belt here. And what we're going to do here is we're going to turn the belt, I think. Because if this belt... Wait, we, we do need the belt buffer as well, though. No, we're going to turn it later. It's fine. We're going to just add it for now. There. This is what happens. Uh, PSA, this is what happens when you build stuff too close together. It's completely unnecessary. But oh well, we have a tendency to do it anyway. So, good. Ah, uh, we got the move speed. The move speed matters so much in the beginning. We are actually going up on that as well, but I think as the oil storage tank starts to fill, uh, it will go back down. So, power. Um, Good. Oh, that's a nice line. I'm just going to follow that line, I think, for a bit until it stops. Oh, I guess it stopped. Mm, let's see. There, good. I kind of want to, uh, when, when placing these, it's nice to drag as much as possible on the horizontal axis of the planet because if you drag it down they might they might get shifted so that's why I'm doing it like this uh, just one line up or down and then connect like so because they will they will not be here we go they will be shifted so if I drag this down and this down and this down and so on there wouldn't be room for all of them that made sense in my head. I guess it makes sense for from the gameplay mechanics perspective as well. Let's see, do we care about the things here? No, so oh, dragging all the power. This isn't what I was supposed to do this episode, but I think it's nice to to do it anyway. See, there we, oh, there we 
go. I guess what's useful is to not care about this direction at all. It's to find... Um... Oh yeah, speaking of too close, too close. But maybe here we can go one closer like so and place them between but that's it's not always a good idea so i'm going to actually do it like this let's do these two and there and the final ones good 100 percent satisfaction because it's not connected to anything so what we are going to do now is we are going to find a spot for our mall and the way we're going to do that is find a place that's very uh, horizontally long as in this location might be good that's where I'm at actually and oh this this location yeah this is where the mall is going to be can I place map markers no so it is southeast of our oil. That's something we can probably find. So how many assemblers do we have? 26. That should be completely fine. We also did a research to get one more construction drone now. That's going to be useful as well. These need to be connected. Good. Okay, so now we have power. This is the oil. I guess we don't need anything else before we start. No. I'm going to set up the machines uh, before let's see, before we do the input because it's going to get its own input. Let's start all the way over here. Let's see. So this So if we start, say, here. Oh, I'm going to check that we can build machines here. I don't think the mall is going to be this long anyway. But No. There. So we place one for measuring. And that would be here. Okay, so what we learned last time is that you can shift out stuff. As in, this belt is going to be, say, um, yeah, what is it going to be? I guess we build a bit up. Let's see how we... Good. It's not going to be copper. We don't need copper. So... I guess we've removed these and this is mm, iron probably so we need iron and gears at least that's two of the basic things so that's iron and gears uh, what else let's see if we start by building our first thing we are also of course going to need um, more advanced stuff so let's just look at a few recipes let's look at them here yeah that's way too complicated here we go so we need iron and gear and um and the squiggly blips and that's here as well iron and gear and the squigglies and this requires grain chips, this requires other stuff, this requires green. Okay, so we definitely need those four. So let's do one belt for greens and one belt for the copper things. And then we can output in both directions. We're leaving, uh, we're giving ourselves some space here. So, let's see. Uh, this is good. Everything that needs those four materials is good. Splitters as well. 
and we need to think a bit when we come to upgrades I guess so let's yeah let's start by doing that uh, let's make a line here actually can pulse go between here is this at the yes oh it looks very tight but it's fine Perfect. so what was it this one right yes and that means we probably want belts as well belts uh, are a special case because they need to be upgraded so this is good we're going to place a storage chest like so or we also need to make storage chest but they need stone right yes so those if I remember correctly, we're a bit later. We need to make sure... What was it? We shifted out something for stone. Uh, this one needs stone, but not gears. That's probably what we shifted out. So, that means if we put iron on this and gears, then it's the gear line is cut somewhere here. So we need to find everything that requires gears. And that would be, let's see, can we, yeah, we can use this. This one doesn't require gear, so that can come a bit later if we wanted to, it can come wherever. This one is going to be annoying. We don't use them anyway, but still, wine wine. This one needs both stone and gear. Oh yes, because that was the um, that was the transition thing. So this needs to be at the end. I'm going to I'm going to place a reminder machine here, just for that. So what else did we need? We, we needed the miners, right? Yes. Those are gears. And then the uh, thermal power. Okay. Uh, what else needs the gears? No. No. Yes. Good. What else needs the gears? These we have. And hopefully, if if we if we made a doo doo now, we uh, let's see. I think that's it. Good. So here I guess we need to set the recipes manually. So that's the gear one. And this one needs both stone and gear. So the stone belt needs to... Oh, I remember this from last time, yes. So anyway, um, this is stone so what do we need that what what needs stone let's see thermal power we have that of course the storage tanks uh, so let's set those up i'm not going to make the mark ii one didn't use it last time don't like it if we decide later we can always set it up later so let's place a few of these without recipes so we need storage chest and storage tank uh, what else oh we need these okay so the oil stuff can those be now I guess they can but they need or oh, these need steel and steel replaced iron if I remember correctly so we need stuff that requires iron uh let's see iron and stone or i guess anything that needs iron matrix lab that's that's glass and i think if i remember correctly we imported glass from below and that was for some special stuff so these are steel we have, let's see, did, oh, oh, did we set up this? 
not yet. So maybe if we do, let's see, this, this is the stone belt, right? So let's just go like this. This is probably the wrong way to do it. I remember it. I, I remember having to like squiggle it in last time. Anyway, anyway, I think this is this is a good start. I think we have most of the things and let's add to this when we feel like we need it. So um, we needed we needed uh, let's see storage storage this needs green did we and this one needs coils as well so maybe the coils and there let's do those there and what about green chips green chips are needed here at least okay so this is the very start of them all um this is gears this is iron so we need to find stuff oh that didn't take long we also need to make so many things now for the mall. Uh, we need to make all of the intermediary products and so on. So every everything that has a belt needs its own array now. And I'm going to do that bigger, I think, this time than uh, was done last time. This is probably fine. I didn't count at all. 6, 7, 5, that's 18. 22 22 kind of wanted to be 24 but then again we already have 10 percent mining productivity so it's fine so that goes here here and here so this is going to be the smelting array for um for the mall and I'm going to leave all of this area for that so this is going to be like an iron smelting island or something that sounds very productive and a full belt what is a full belt anyway 24 maybe <laughs> I don't remember 12 and 30 okay so that means a full weight, 30, and this is 12, but we have new smelters now, right? So if we want a belt of 30, we only need 15. What is it here? Yes, that's very expensive though. So let's see if we have room for 30. Definitely not. We have, what, why? Hello? Hmm. Is it because we only had 18? Maybe we can only make this many. Okay. So if iron comes down here, see, this, this is why I want to leave the belt. Um, and I'm actually going to. So this belt is going to merge. At some point this is going to be gone and we probably replace it with something. I kind of want the belt to go the other way by this one. So we remove that and set it the other way. And then we start here with the smelters. Let's see, that was 18 to six, that was 12. Isn't that fine? Isn't that just brilliant? 12, I think it is. So we go here, we go here. And we go in and out and set the recipe. That's iron plate. And then we need all the belts placed. So do we use this patch only for iron plates though? Here is much more iron as well. 
I don't actually know. This is something I haven't planned ahead on at all. It doesn't need that much iron, the, the mall itself. But it, it might need more than we expect. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to pretend that we are going to do a good job. So we are actually going to use materials, which means that we need, let's see, did that one hit? Yeah, it did. So that means this, four between, four between and there. And then we need here. Yeah, so, so I am going to build with the thought of us getting to a place where we actually use a lot of resources. So this is a full Mark II belt of of iron plate so that means let's leave some room for miners here so we connect it here this is where we could have used the diagonal belt i guess to go directly uh, but we might actually use some of this iron for for gears yeah, I can't I can't use a full belt for everything, right? So it's okay to to do some other stuff with this as well. Is it though? Yes, it is. I have decided it is. Therefore it is. So I guess I guess we place how many? I, I have no idea how many of these we're going to need, but if we place too many, it will buffer up. So one a second, two a second. Um, if we upgrade this, it's going to be better, of course. So let's do four a second of the gears. That would go here. That would go one. And down one and in. Good. And now we need uh, green chips. So I think that's going to get, is that going to use the same iron? Hmm. What a conundrum. I think it is. I think it is. But we are going to make it in a location that's easy to to change stuff up in. So we need more smelters. Let's see. We need more iron. Oh, I want to connect this to power now. Like right this instant so we can get the iron here. But I'm going to go back for it anyway, because I think that's quicker. So, did we get the sale? No. We need to do science. I keep forgetting to do the science. Uh, let's see. Do we have all the upgrades? No. This one. There's the sale. And I guess for everything else here... Oh no. We have red. Oh, we have red here as well. Nice. And the rest is like that. Oh, I'm, I'm still levitating. I need to land. There we go. Let's just get some resources here. And make smelters. What was it? 12 for each, right? So we probably need quite a bit. Let's go like so. And we are probably going to need a lot more, a lot more inserters. Five. We're probably going to need a little more belts. And probably more of these. Oh, and more of these. Uh, yeah, this is enough to start. And then 
once we start the mall, did, did we remember the actual sorters in the mall? No. Okay, so that's something we need to sort. Okay, okay. Oof, I'll be here all day. So, um, sorters, let's say. We need many of them, and and we need a location for them in the mall as well. No idea where, but we'll find a spot for them, I'm sure. Let's see, this one. Wow, nice. Extra iron. Good. And, of course, we are not going to make the green stuff. Yeah, this is good. The whole um, operation is going to eat so many more um, inserters than I sorters, sorry, than I expect. I think, which doesn't make sense because, yeah. Anyway, there are going to be miscalculations, and we're going to miss a lot of stuff we need, like these. So that's iron again. Storage. 16 okay so let's call that fine for now and go back I really really enjoy this part of uh, a playthrough making the stuff we need to make all the stuff let's see we have power poles right yes so we need to connect those oh, this that spot I think let's go on this row instead I guess we don't really have to plan this out like I'm doing right now as long as they connect this is always movable later <clears throat> there we go that's the mecha sail so this means now, we can leave the planet as well. To the whole and oh, and we get cluster. tutorial pop-up spread as well. Amazing. This looks a bit depressing. It needs, let's see. Yeah, we need much more mining going on. Much more. What's Oh, we don't have them. Let's make them in the mall. Or, yeah, let's make them in the mall. I'm not going to craft them right now. So, this was supposed to be the gears. I wonder why I did it that way. This just extra squiggles. I'm going to change it just to clean up a bit. Let's see. There. So, if we go this way. Yeah, that's much better. That's how it goes when, when placing something and then just extrapolate from there or keep building from there instead of actually thinking of what we already placed. So in and out. And there. Oh, that's so convenient. <laughs> so... Uh, let's see, needs a bit more power than, than a lonely power pole that's not connected to anything. Good. Now, why aren't we getting iron? Because we, oh, we connected the ore belt. Glad that was spotted before we had a uh, thing. Oh. Diagonal belt. So, um, <laughs> here we go, here we go, 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 builder pots. Oh, that, that was a big one. We got an additional drone task, which means they carry several items. Uh, that's, that's major. Okay, so these ones, let's place the sorter in the middle. I don't think we need faster sorters, do we? Uh, let's see. How quick. 
half a trip a second, so two seconds each item. I don't think that's going to be an issue for many things, maybe for conveyor belts and stuff, but not for anything else. And, and everything else seems to be at least two seconds a craft. Sorters and belts are special. Okay, so then we go like so and try the plus thing. There we go. Two. Nice. This actually works. Well, of course it does. Everything in this game is so smooth for it being uh, early access and all. Ah, oh, these power poles even fit between. So two, four. That's fine. One, two, three, four. This is, of course, something we need to move if we want stuff between. Good. Then we connect here. And then I guess we need poles between as well. Yes. Or do we? Ah. Mm. Do you? No, they do connect. Nice, nice. So uh, we also need to set up these on the other side. And I guess nothing. Oh, and yeah, belts. Belts are fine already. As the only thing that is, I guess. So iron in. And I guess the belt one was the one we needed to upgrade as well. Okay. Oh, and we move even faster now. This is good. So where do we place inserters? Green and iron. So I guess we can place them all the way over here. I kind of want them closer though. So uh, let's see. We can shift all of them by doing this. Yes. So you go there and the miner seems a bit misplaced. So if we move the miner here, miner, no, we can't have it there. We need more space because this is going to duplicate. This is, so maybe we put it at the very beginning. So if we put this here and then at the very beginning we have the sorters. I think that's good. I, I like it. Yeah. So uh, the longest belt is the green ones, right? Because yes, there. So that means you get an inserter here and an inserter here and we limit the chest a tiny bit wait did we decide we want the chests though not on these well we want to upgrade them but we don't need i'm going to keep it exactly like this belts do not need either my I don't think so. I think we're going to, this is me jumping over thoughts and not explaining them all. But I think be because of the way stuff is done, we might not keep the lower upgrade in a box, but we'll see. It doesn't hurt really, so. So what we're going to do now is mine some copper. Uh, oh, lack of item. Oh no, oh no. What was it we needed? A urn. Okay. So that's here. Um, do we need... Let's see. If we... If we do the inserters here. Let's see. This one needs iron. And it needs... It needs all four. That was easy.
good. That means we can place it in like so, because we have a lot of the green and the squiggles. So if we limit the chests, should have limited before we copied, I guess. And what is this? The assemblers, that's fine. That that one we need more of. This one we don't need more of. Don't use a lot of these. Okay. Um miners. Lack of item. So if we go above things, let's see, we need 12, so that's 12, right, 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3, yes, that's 12, very quick, so this is the in belt, and this is the out belt, I think it goes this way, because it needs to meet stuff down here. So, with this, we are going to make green chips. And I think we need two machines for that. That seems so little, but I don't think we need more than that. So, uh, let's do that. And then, uh, these are also going to need be needed for the squiggles. Uh, but let's see. Here we go. Two up. Oh, is this really a thing? Uh, this was the green chips. Yeah, sure. It's the green chips. So we need it to go like here, maybe. Then we go down. Here. Oh, it's, it's not even... Yeah, it's convenient. Wait, might not be. We, we need to mine this side, right? Um, let's see. It actually fits. It actually fits well enough, yeah. Yep, it's good. I'm happy with it. So, uh, we go here and here. And these ones go here and under and there. Good. Now we have all the copper. We need inserters for just one of them because, as they say, this is so convenient. Okay, and then power poles. That was here, here, and there. And this one needs power poles. This, here it doesn't fit between. Uh, let's see, yeah, this is, this is nice enough. We remove a few of these to put a splitter here. That's fine. Do we want a second floor of splitter? No. No, this is good. There we go. So, green chips. Iron in, green chip out. And copper in copy paste. So I think that's it. Yep, it is. But the out one needs to be a bit quicker. And the in one does as well. Mm -hmm. Let's see. And now it's speed. Six, oh no, that's the conveyor belt. There. One and a half a second. Yeah, perfect. Is it? No. It's not perfect, but it's good enough until we get the last upgrade. 
So there's that. And then we have uh, something very similar uh, where we do where we do a belt. That can be here probably. No, wait. It needs. There we go. So if this is the output belt, I guess we just up it one more floor. Yeah. So the input belt can go here. And the output belt can go here. And then we go up to. Then we need to hold the shift button to not attach to anything. Don't want our belts to get attached. Then we click the tab. Why do you not want to be built there? Isn't that good enough for the belt? No. Well, let's just go here. And then we click the tab again to make corners. Go all the way down and there. This seems, it looks so incredibly messy. I'm not sure what I think about it, but it's not going to lower our efficiency and I don't think it's going to make anything less clear either. So I'm going to keep it like that. Um, and for this, we are going to do exactly the same as these, but we want to leave room for two more, right? So there, let's see, there, one, two, and then this one. Oh, no. Oh, we don't get to build. Okay, well, it doesn't matter. We can still build these two. If we need more, we want some room in here. So this one is for the squigglies, the coils. There we go. Powerful. And then we need some smelting of the other stuff down here. Now, do we want them to share belts? Do we split the belt? What do we do with this? I think we just split the belt. So, you need foundation support. So, there. So, this is the out belt going here. This is the in belt going here ish. And. Then we paste you again for the inserters. Change the recipe to this. Oh wait, this needs more. This one is slower. So instead of 12, we need 18. One, two, three, four, five, six, more. Yeah, that makes sense. The reason why I find this a fine thing to do, or an okay thing to do, is that both of these need iron ore, and later on we have to import it from different planets. So having an iron ore belt that's split, well for now it's going to be split anyway, let's see, uh, is something that I'm fine with because of that. If this is something we're going to add to anyway. So let's just go here. There. There. And there. And I think this is going to be enough. I, I really believe that. Now, what we should have done is build it. No, I, I should have built it closer, I guess, but I like to leave some breathing room and if we feel like we need the space we can go occupy a different planet and, and use that space. So uh, you have inserters as well and there we go, there we go and there we go. Why aren't you guys putting anything now? 
Did I make a mistake? Yes, I did. I flipped the inserters. Let's see if... No. No. Okay. So... Uh, remove there. Go here. And then place this again. And then place this. Let's see. Oh, this can go from the other side. We don't need to... Yeah, so leave it here. And remove this. And there. It's so much quicker now that they have two tasks each. So, we are getting there now. We just need um, this belt. And then we have... Uh, the first four belts into our mall and, and that means we have all of the basic equipment that's that's neat um so let's move along this belt to build it a bit quicker let's also do some science i keep forgetting so we finished the upgrades right we did all of them no not this one okay and then, yeah, that one's fine. There isn't that much we need right now because we we are at point where we where we um, can make everything. Oh, this one is important for the thing. Cracking is probably something we should get as well. Let's see, this one requires thruster. Let's just have them running. We can always just switch them out later if we need something. The important part is that we actually do science and I've stopped for a while, so. So, good. Um, let's see. Yeah, this is good. This is good. Let's look at our mall now. Oh, this thing. Ah. Uh -uh. Oh. Yeah, I wonder what I think about that. I, I just can't decide. So, uh, iron, gear, and green. And green. This one is done. Yes. This one is iron, gear, and green. Gear and green. This one is squigglies, iron and gear. Gear and iron and squigglies. This one is the first one that needs stone. So now we need to sort that somehow. Maybe there and cut. Maybe we bring the stone here. So, so this belt goes in. Maybe we switch these two belts. I don't know. So this one needs squiggly stone and iron. So let's do iron and squigglies. We can't get more here without having stone. So I guess that that's something we have to sort. But for now, uh, let's look at this. Looks like we have a lock of iron, but that will... This is, this is a buffering issue. The whole thing will buffer and then it's set. We have... Yeah, we, we have a, a nice little buffer of uh, sorters already. We have a nice little buffer of belts as well. So let's just let everything buffer and then we see what we need. I think that's a good idea. Uh, because while this is happening, the green chips and the blue chips 
they are they they are kind of done buffering which will lead the rest of the iron here and of course this will I was going to say this will be quicker when we get quicker bells but they won't because it's a mining issue but oh well so we have the first parts of our um, mall set up now so we are going to have this is nice only two it's fine we are going to have all the items we need to build our basic base this isn't needed actually if we aren't going to use it going to build them anyway just in case but yeah so next mission is stone i guess i can't see any here's stone is that the closest one probably yeah so this is going to be a long belt this is going to be a very long belt but that's fine i think maybe it's very simple to just bring the stone in from the other side and just turn this belt that should like here and then we can insert it here and then we can insert it everywhere yeah all of these need stone and then we we also need to set up we, we don't have the more advanced stuff we don't have the i think it was steel they needed yeah steel and, and the glass thing. So that's something we need to set up as well. I should... I was thinking I should write it down, but I think we'll notice when, when we need something and we can just add it. And this isn't going to be a very clean project, so I'm okay with splashing it out somewhere else as well. So I think that's it for now. We have our mall started we are getting a lot of stuff i think this one is fine with 40. so anyway anyway in the next episode we'll make sure we get the stone in at least and then after all of the tech we might even visit a different planet but we'll see oh stone anyway <laughs> thank you all for watching and i hope you enjoyed the spaghetti Bye-bye.